Hey folks, um, today is April 17th, it's currently 8.53 in the morning, and I actually need to disconnect real quick, and then reconnect. And I'm also using a different uh, recording software. My uh, the BB Flashback Express recorder that I was using uh, crashed on me yesterday. Luckily, I was able to uh, record that final video so you guys could see an overview of uh, what happened in yesterday's trading. But after that, I did a few more tests and it just completely crashed on me. So it's not working at all anymore. What I'm using right now is this Screencast O Matic. It's just a, uh, a free uh, recording software that you can. Basically, uh, just click on record screencast and it'll let you record uh, any screen that you wanted to. So hopefully this will turn out okay. I'm not sure how the quality is going to be, but hopefully it'll be all right. And let's see here. Two minute hasn't started uh, moving yet. But on our 300 tick, we can see our high volume node is beneath us. Got this reversal bar or a reversal line right here, right within this uh, selling zone. All right, so we're going to uh, just be patient. And also, I forgot to mention this has a 15 minute uh, limit, time limit. So I'm going to have to uh, try to cut down my time here. All right, be back with you guys shortly. All right, guys, we have this uh, print that just showed up here. Let me see if this is a selling. All right, so that's a buying uh, level. But we have the high volume node right above us. Yeah, we'll be safe. Order canceled. No telling if it's going to get filled, but it's no point in taking the risk, pushing right into this buy zone. And it's starting to push up anyway. All right, I'll be back on the next opportunity. Hi, right, folks. I just wanted to come back real quick. We just got this print right here. But as you can see, we are right in the middle of this sell zone from way back here. And it has held for quite some time. It's been hit several times. And that's why we're not uh, taking this trade here. As you can see, we haven't really had any prints or very many opportunities to jump in. The vendor, he uh, jumped in at this level from the two-minute chart. I don't really trade off the two-minute chart. But as you can see, this uh, bar would not have come up enough to fill us on this uh, print. But he says he holds the high volume node prints for two or three bars and just the scalp trades for one bar. So that's uh, something new. I'm going to hopefully next week start looking into that as well. Taking these uh, high volume node prints off of the two minute bar or the two minute charts, excuse me. But it's already uh, two o'clock. It is Friday. Market hasn't, uh, it's been moving, but it hasn't really given us a lot of opportunities to jump in. If you guys recall this trade right here. Wouldn't have been filled. Market went sideways, so we wouldn't have got filled into this trade. This trade was directly into the high volume node, so I didn't take that. And we just had this print. And obviously, it's in a uh, pretty well established selling zone, so I'm not going to be uh, taking that trade either. So, not a lot of opportunities. And of course, the vendor did take a trade. As the market came down to this sell zone or this uh, buying zone right here, actually it's a buying uh, low volume node. So he took a trade off of this, which is this uh, print right here on the two minute chart. But like I said, I don't really have any experience taking these trades yet, so no such luck there for me. This has actually been a really short week. Not a lot of opportunity for me this week, and with uh, yesterday, I think it was yesterday, I didn't have an opportunity to trade that much, but Let's go ahead here and take a look what we were able to do this week, even though it was a short week. Uh, let's 
let me see here. Start the 13th to the 17th, change this to currency. Make sure everything else is right. Generate. All right, so this week we were able to make $450. Again, this was a extremely slow week for me. A lot of uh, things popped up that didn't allow me to trade for uh, a large portion of the week here. So hopefully next week I won't have as many issues. And also I'd like to see how this video uploads to YouTube. Hopefully the quality will be okay when you guys will be able to uh, actually see that that says 450 right here and things like that. But we'll see shortly. All right, let me get this back. All right, that's going to be it for today's video, and uh, hopefully this shows up properly. I'll see you guys on Monday. Take care, folks. Have a great weekend.